Hello, welcome to the body tab demo and tutorial and the first option under the body tab is your background option and from here you can apply any background color to the body. I'm choosing this one and apart from the color of the gallery you can go to more for wide range of color collections and this is your dropper and you can choose the color from any desired location and just click on OK. And the body background is changed. Apart from the color, you have the gradients option also. You can apply any of the gradient from the gallery or for advanced gradients, you can go to the more option. Here you can have the linear gradient in which shades are in straight line or the radial gradients for the circular patterns. This is your gradient strip and just single click on the strip to add a gradient stop and double click to add color to the gradient stop and next option is the angle option in which you can rotate the gradient after the color and the gradient you have the images option You can choose any of the background image according to your requirement and here are the image options. You can repeat your image in horizontal or vertical direction. You can set the stretch to fill uniform and uniform to fill transparency of the background image can be set and horizontal alignment option can be left center or right. A vertical alignment option can be top, center and bottom. Next is your texture option. Here you can add texture to the background from the gallery. Apart from textures, you can add effects also. Here are the various effects you can add to the body backgrounds. Coming to the type of layout, you have two options, either fixed or scroll. In the fixed case, your body background will be fixed with respect to the browser viewport. You can see the background here is fixed. And next is your scroll option in which the body background will scroll with the elements. This is your scroll option and here I am setting the type to be fixed only. Next is your scroll to top button gallery and here are the various arrows you can use from the gallery. Then you have the browse option, you can browse your own arrow according to your requirement. And for customization of the arrow you can go to more. So suppose I am selecting this one. Here is the scroll to top button and for customization first option is the background of the scroll to top button and the border for the scroll to top button and under border you have the styling options border thickness you can set radius of the border and color of the border next is the arrow background here i am going to change the background of the arrow the background of the arrow is changed and next option is the arrow border you can choose the color for the arrow border and thickness of the arrow border can be set from here next is your layout option and i'm setting the height and width of the arrow and just from here i'm applying the changes last option under the body tab is the bookmark option and here I am saving my bookmark as bookmark and just click on the button to save your bookmark for the later use. Just click here to see the saved bookmark. This is your saved bookmark. This is your view in the desktop and next I am going to the tablet view. And here is the view of the tablet. After tablet, I'm going to the mobile view and this is your 
mobile view bring back to the desktop that's all for the body tab keep watching our next videos also thank you